there's this really dynamic system in which the experience of childhood adversity can impact folks, can impact their health, it can impact their mental health and well-being, their attachment and their ability to form relationships. Yeah. And that can significantly increase the risk of someone ending up in poverty, right? Someone having challenges in the workplace, someone having mental health um, at conditions. We know that the higher your A score, the, the greater the risk of um, mental health and behavioral problems, the greater the risk of substance dependence, right? As well as, you know, of, of other health problems as well. And so, um, and we also know that for individuals who are um, low income or who are in poverty, that, um, that they have fewer resources, right? Yeah. It's more challenging to get high quality services and interventions. Um, but the other thing that we also know that the data sh shows us very powerfully is that adverse childhood experiences happen in all communities. Mm -hmm. They happen in every income group with every race, race and ethnicity. And in fact, we know it, they, it, they happen all over the globe, right? Yeah. And so one of the things that we're really understanding now is that it's in all of our interest to find, um, to work together to use some of the emerging science that we're now learning about um, that undergirds this connection between early adversity and health problems to, to really develop solutions for everyone.